wanting people to listen, you can't just tap them on the shoulder anymore. You have to hit them with a sledgehammer. And then you'll notice you've got their strict attention. I've been trying to figure something in my head. Maybe you can help me out, yeah? When a person is insane, as you clearly are, do you know that you're insane? John Doe has the upper hand. Gluttony, greed, law, wrath, pride, lust, and envy. John Doe has the upper hand. Maybe you're just sitting around, eating guns and ammo, masturbating in your own pieces. You just stop and go, wow, it is amazing how fucking crazy I really am. John Doe has the upper hand. It's more comfortable for you to label me insane. It's very comfortable. It's not something I would expect you to accept. But I did not choose. I was chosen. It's the you were chosen, that is, by a higher power. If your hand was forced, it seems strange to me that you would get such enjoyment out of it. You want somebody dead, you drive by and shoot them. You don't risk the time it takes to do this. Unless the act itself has meaning. You enjoy torturing those people. Doesn't seem in keeping with part of them, does it? This should not be his first assignment. Oh, come on. This is not my first assignment. I doubt I enjoyed it anymore. Then Detective Wells would enjoy time alone with me in a room without windows. Isn't that true? How happy would it make you to hurt me with impunity? It's too soon for me. Hey man, you know, I'm right here. You say this shit in my face. Man, it's too soon for me. I would never be with him because there's consequences. It's in those eyes of yours, though. Nothing wrong with a man taking pleasure in his work. I won't deny my own personal desire to turn each sin against the sinner. Ooh, wait a minute, I thought all you did was kill innocent people. Innocent? Is that supposed to be funny? A beast man, a disgusting man who could barely stand up. A man who, if you saw him on the street, you pointed out to your friends so that they could join you in mocking him. A man who, if you saw him while you were eating, you wouldn't be able to finish your meal. And after him, I picked a lawyer, and you both must have secretly been thanking me for that one. This, this is, is a man who dedicated his life to making money by lying with, with every breath that he could have mustered to keep the murderers and rapists on the streets. Murderers. A woman. Murderers, John. Like a woman. So ugly on the inside that she couldn't bear to go on living if she couldn't be beautiful on the outside. You like what you do for a living? These things are so a, a drug dealer, a, a drug dealing pederast, actually. And let's not forget the disease spreading for. No, I don't. That's life, isn't it? Oh, you love this shitty. Could you even try to say these were innocent people and keep a straight face? He's not. He's just a man. You know, this isn't going to have a happy ending. But that's, that's the point. point. We, we see a deadly, deadly sin on every street corner, in every home, home. and we, we tolerate it. it. We tolerate it because it's common. It's, it's trivial. We, we tolerate it in more than a minute. Well, well, not anymore. I'm setting an example. example. And, and what I've done is going to be puzzled over, over and studied. studied. You're no messiah, you're a, you're a movie of the week. You're a fucking loser, at best. You got what you deserve. And you should be thanking me. Why is that, John? Because you're going to be remembered after this. Realize.
nice detective. The only reason that I'm here right now is that I wanted to be. No. No, we would have got you a Oh, really? So, what were you doing? Biding your time? Toying with me? Allowing five innocent people to die until you felt like springing your trap? Tell me, what was the indisputable evidence you were going to use on me right before I walked up to you and put my hands in the air? John, calm down. I seem to remember us knocking on your door. Oh, that's right. And I seem to remember breaking your face. because I didn't kill you. Okay, sit back. I spared you. Sit back! Remember that, detective, every time you look in the mirror at that face of yours for the rest of your life. Or should I say, for the rest of what life? Sit I back! You. Sit back, you fucking freak! Don't ask me to pity those people. I don't mourn them any more than I do the thousands that died at Sodom and Gomorrah. That's the same time that... What you were doing was God's good work. The Lord works in mysterious ways. Get him out. second part.